Hey guys, welcome back. If you're new or just stopping by, I'm Shay, a health and wellness coach to help you be a better version of you on the inside and out. So this week, I wanna show you guys a vegan chicken Alfredo. So the ingredients used will be vegan chicken, chickpea noodles, red bell peppers, green bell peppers, vegan Alfredo sauce, some sea salt, arugula, onion powder, cayenne, red pepper, and grapeseed oil. So go ahead and drizzle some grapeseed oil in a pan and put the water in the pot for the noodles. Turn that to high and the pot to medium. Dice up the green bell peppers and red bell peppers. Here, the chickpea noodles have 23 grams of protein, eight grams of fiber, gluten-free, non-GMO, and vegan. Once the water begins to boil, add the noodles in the water and turn to about 10 minutes to boil. Add the green bell peppers and rebel peppers so they can saute. Stir the green bell peppers and red bell peppers so they can soften, and as well stir the chickpea noodles so it doesn't stick. Add two teaspoons of water and then add the vegan meat and cover for about 10 to 12 minutes. Of course, stir as needed. Once the 10 minutes has passed, go ahead and set the noodles aside and drain. And of course, continue to stir and let the vegan chicken cook thoroughly. Now it's time to add the noodles and the sauce. I'm just showing you here, the vegan Alfredo sauce is non-GMO, it uses cashews, and has about 70 calories. Add your own desired amount and stir as needed. Now it's time for the spices. Sprinkle in a little bit of sea salt.
I added two teaspoons of onion powder. Half a teaspoon of red pepper flakes and half a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. And about a cup of arugula. Now you can use any vegetable of your choice. You use kale, asparagus, green beans, spinach, whatever you use. Just a disclaimer, arugula has a distinct taste. So if you've never had arugula, you might want to use a different type of vegetable because it gives it a different type of flavor. And continue to stir to allow everything to cook together. and your meal is ready. I hope you enjoy. And one more thing before I go, make sure you use this vegan Parmesan on top. It enhances the flavor. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, and share. Be you, think naturally. Thank you guys again. Bye.